All right, sharpen your scissors. Take your cat. Put your cat away. Make an environment that's safe for your bunny. This bunny has never been shorn before. This is a three-month-old German doe. She has some matting on the top of her wool. She lived with her sister for her entire life. And um, the matting doesn't go all the way down to the wool. You'll be able to see that. But what we're doing is we're just taking a look at the dough. We're moving slow. Don't move fast. Make sure you're calm yourself. This rabbit's never been put on her back um, at all before. So this will be the first time doing it. Take your arm, put it on the back, take another arm, holding underneath the front arms of the rabbit, and you kind of squeeze, place them down gently. So none of the movements are fast. Rabbits get a little finicky if you're loud, moving around a lot. If they flip back over on their feet, just do the same thing. Gently place them back down. If you need to, you can have a seat. Feel free to take your time. You can always take a break too. If you need to, you can set the rabbit down back on the floor. And when you're ready, just set them down in your lap, move from the table onto your lap, and start trimming their back foot area. Start trimming by their tail, just slow movements. If you start pulling wool hard, if you start pulling their legs hard, they may get scared and they may move. After the tail area is trimmed, after the back legs are trimmed, you want to trim the belly area. You want to trim underneath the bib. She was getting feisty at this point, so we just take her down, set her on the floor, and relax. After she gets a break, we come back, set her on the table because her belly's done, see how she's doing. We trim up the top of her. You can tell she's calm. She just hunkers down. We move on to the back. You can see when I pull that wool, the top matting. And just keep trimming. So here she is. She is all done. And it's not just a matter of taking your rabbit and putting it back in the pen. Since this is her first time being shorn, she needs you to get used to being touched. She needs to get used to being handled. So that's what we do. We pet her. We let her know it's okay. We feel her body. We make sure nothing odd is going on. And she did very well for her first time shearing. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching.